Hey guys, it's Jess, the Glam Pixie, and today I'm going to be trying out a possible beauty hack using Just For Men Beard Dye on my eyebrows. Okay, so here's the deal. One of my students told me that she's been using Just For Men Beard Dye to dye her eyebrows. Myself being a natural blonde, I was very, very intrigued. I wanted to know, does it work? Is it gonna look ridiculous? I mean, aren't we all a little bit curious about this? So I thought, why not try it out for you guys? So today I'm gonna be using the color medium dark brown and we'll see what happens. Okay, so I've removed the makeup from my eyebrows and the surrounding area. So you can see it has a weird like McDonald's arch of pale white skin <laughs> under my face. And now I'm gonna take the color base. You guys can see that. And I'm gonna squeeze just a little bit of this into this little applicator bowl that they give you. Not very much. I don't think you're gonna need much. Then it says to take equal parts of the developer. So I'm gonna take that developer and put an equal amount or close to equal amount of that. Now it comes with a little like beard applicator, but I'm not gonna use that. I'm actually gonna use the same brush that I apply my eye makeup to my eyebrows. And I'm just gonna use that and mix it up. Now I'm just gonna take a little bit of that mixture and apply it to the hair on my eyebrows. Trying not to get any on the surrounding skin. This is really difficult because you can't see where you're applying it. So I'm really hoping that I'm not going way out of my lines. I definitely don't want like bushy caterpillar eyebrows. Okay, so it's starting to change colors just a little bit, not tons, but enough to where I can see where I applied it. So I'm just gonna go in and fill in any little bald spots that I see. I do have really sparse eyebrows, so I'm gonna use this opportunity to kind of fill them in. Now I'm gonna move to the other eyebrow. So you can see my right eyebrow has really developed heavily. Um, I'm hoping that it's even. It looks really, really bold right now, but hopefully it'll wipe off and not look too Groucho marks. Now that I've applied to both eyebrows, I'm gonna go ahead and let it process for just under five minutes. All right, so now that I've let this process for just under five minutes, I'm gonna go ahead and take a wet washcloth and I'm just gonna remove the dye as best I can. Oh, wow. <gasps> hey, I feel like that worked pretty well. So this is with everything completely wiped off. I feel like it definitely did darken them but not to the point where it's too extreme. Like I could actually, at this point, if this is how it stays, I could just throw on like a BB cream or something and some mascara and not even touch my eyebrows. Unlike if I was just going, you know, to the grocery store or just running outside for some quick errands and not have to worry about grooming my eyebrows at all. Cause it's definitely darker than it was, but not so extreme that it looks out of place or is like crazy, crazy out there. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill in where my foundation was so I don't look so crazy to kind of give you guys the final look. This is it. No eyebrow makeup at all. It's definitely a lot darker, but still looks natural. It doesn't look like I pasted on a heavy paint on my eyebrows, which is really awesome. I think that it looks really pretty. I'm hoping that it lasts as long as people say. It's supposed to last for about two weeks, but we'll see. 
it was a really easy process it's very affordable and I still have tons of dye left over so I'm really excited about this I think for not having any eyebrow makeup on they look pretty good they're definitely darker than my natural brows and they look well groomed without being overly done still looks pretty natural to me so I hope this helped you guys if you liked it, please give it a big ol' thumbs up and subscribe and make sure to look out every Saturday at noon Eastern time for me and a brand new video. Bye guys!